the priest who officiated at our wedding, who we really, really enjoyed, he asked if we were having the wedding filmed. You know, they are, they're making a video, and so after you have made all these people watch the video three times, you make sure you watch it every anniversary. It'll remind you of why you got married and, and how you feel. We were getting ready in a house that I grew up in that is over 100 years old. One of the cameramen just took my dad off to the side and did a little segment with him talking about the importance of the house to our family. That's something that's, you know, I'm, I'm gonna have forever. Yeah, there's a lot of history here. And uh, it, it, it's, a, it's a house that has a lot of character. And it was your mom's house and he grew up there. And it was the first house that we lived in together. Since we've gotten married, we sold the house. So to be able to memorialize that space and kind of not only remember it, but remember being in it and on such a special day is something that otherwise we would never had. Things go by so quickly that you sort of have no idea what's going on around you. There was a point actually right before our first look where we had come off the bus and I was walking very quickly <laughs> towards where the first look was gonna happen. And I turned around <laughs> and you were there and you were so unobtrusive to the process. <laughs> Babe. <laughs> the son-father dance that we did in, in, in place of the mother-son dance. I had no idea what I was doing during the dance, and to see me dancing with my dad, our moves were absolutely awful. And it's so wonderful to see to how though. terrible they are, but like committed and just, <laughs> you know, I mean, that's 24 years of just a strong relationship with my dad and love coming together into one moment. And so to have that on video and be able to watch that it's invaluable. And then we rewatched it and there is a discernible moment where he tries to walk off which the is, floor. Which is the best part. <laughs> it's the little moments that you don't expect happening on mm -hmm. the day that happen organically and get captured. And I feel like those are the moments you don't get in a photo. You don't get the little things like your dad trying to walk off. You would just have a photo of him <laughs> dancing. And those are the things that, to your point, really do make your day your day. You've been my best friend ever since we met. Mallory, I promise that I will work each day to be the best husband that I can be for you. You go through a day like today and you realize how much your, your daughter who was, oh, I'm sorry, <laughs> your daughter who was your little baby has grown up. After our wedding, I really was interested in kind of turning wedding planning, which I had really enjoyed, into a career and kind of a passion point for me. So I used the connections that we had through our own wedding planning and through our wedding venue. And then in March of 2015, I opened my own company, Shy Chic Weddings and Events. And it's been a really cool journey to watch it kind of grow and kind of just to pay it forward and return the favor of how amazing our wedding vendors were to us. It's really important that you not only find wedding vendors that are on a service level and a level of professionalism that is really speaks to you and is a good fit for your own style, but also their chemistry with each other. We're, we're really, really glad that we made the decision that we did, um, both to have a video as well as with who we worked with. You really do appreciate the fact that your day was captured and that you get to watch it over and over again. I watched, and I think we both did, like ad nauseum, that video. Really disgusting, really embarrassing amount. I watch it too, but you don't even know that I'm watching it. That's, you know, how Aww. obsessive I am clicking it. So. <laughs> I'll keep you.